Here are my top 15 back to school organization storage and life hack tips for you. Number one, drink all the coffee ever. Have motivational phrases on hand to keep you inspired. Purge excess items. Your crafters, man, you know you have excess items. You're borderlining on hoarding any day now, so lay it all out on the floor. Let's be honest, you don't need everything in there. Pick what you want to keep, pick what you want to purge, and donate what you don't have to have. You need to create space for creativity, yo. I like to store paint in a cabinet. Number one, it keeps it all together in one spot. Number two, it's upright, so less chance of spilling, and I am really great at spilling things. Number three, you're protecting it from light, so it won't change from sun exposure. When storing your fabric, roll it up the long way and put it in a nice little bin. This prevents wrinkling and it keeps it compact. When storing pom-poms, put them in a sealable plastic bag. Push out any extra air by sort of rolling it up. Push out the air, seal it, and then you have the most compact, small little bag of pom-poms and they're safe from your beagle who likes to eat pom-poms. When storing supplies and tools, use glass or clear containers so that you can see right inside and know what you need. You grab it and go, man. Make labels with a label maker or just post-its and a pen for those non-see-through containers. Upcycle old cigar boxes to store small items. You can totally customize these and they usually cost like a dollar. Use a color-coded clipboard system to organize paperwork. Hang a magnetic knife bar on your wall to store your scissors, yo. So cool. Utilize the bottom of closets by making your own shelves. All you need is a little piece of wood for the lip on either side and to cut a piece of wood that fits right on top. Extra storage for the win. It also helps to have a cute boy install them because, you know, hey, I have needs too. Buy or make adhesive decals to jazz up those plastic storage bins. I made some in contact paper in Memphis design inspired shapes that I showed you in my organization video on Monday. Check it out. Adhesive wall hooks are a great temporary solution for hanging things. Specifically, I like hanging my writing utensils on them near my calendar or my chalkboard wall. Use cork, painter's tape, and spray paint to create a graphic bulletin board for your wall like I showed you how in Rue Magazine. Bring your own style and design into your desk accessories. Let form meet function to give you a little bit of inspiring aesthetic when you are hard at work. I hope these 15 tips helped you out. See how I brought them into fruition with these before and after pictures of my office.